Hi everyone, welcome to February Empties. I put skip ahead times below for each section and I try to put the new items at the end of the section so that you don't have to watch if you're a regular, you already know what I think of my regular reused products. So jumping in, this is a fail. It's Trader Joe's hair serum. I love their conditioner that's in the tube. It's actually a leave-in mask. I use it before shampoo and I also use it on my dry hair. I love that stuff. It's in a tube. This, no, it's used up to here. I am gonna let it go. It's just not my cup of tea. This olive oil, sweet orange oil, I got it from Walmart. It smells really nice and it's a nice conditioner for rotating. My absolute unconditional favorite is this Suave Moroccan Infusion. I love both the shampoo and the conditioner. These are phenomenal for hydrating my dry bleach blonde hair. And my Revlon, I usually mix 04 with another one in the 80s or 70s, depending on how light or how dark I want it. And I only color the roots and I'll link a video below of how I do my hair. This Kirkland Gummies, Mark was at Costco and kindly picked me up a two pack Unfortunately, it was gummies. I don't like to eat my calories. I'll drink them, but I'm not gonna eat them in a vitamin. I do eat them in food, I should clarify. <laughs> but these also have sugar. I just used them up. I think they came in a two pack, so I'm glad that they're done. Other things that I take is this Peruria Morifica. It's a estrogen, and there's gonna be a hormone video coming up. Melatonin, I keep this beside my bed in case I have problems sleeping. I love this stuff. I really like the Spring Valley brand and I'm trying out an Amazon brand, so I'll let you know what I think of that. This turmeric, both Mark and I take this. You have to get the one with the black pepper and this is a really good quality one. I buy this over and over again from Amazon. I'll put a link below if you're interested. I used up this Equate eye drop. I have a lot of eye drops I'm trying to use up. I do like the Lumify because it gets the red out better than probably anything else. But when I had my Sjogren's, I had a lot of dry eye problems, so I'm just trying to use up some that I still have around. This Vitacost Rosehip Seed Oil. I love Rosehip Seed Oil, and I'm a mad chemist with my oils. I usually buy mine from Garden of Wisdom. This is from when I used to place Vitacost orders, which I no longer do. I'm trying to really be cognizant of my purchases because I just have too much stuff. This Crest toothpaste, another little sample from the dentist. Now that we don't travel, I'm not saving these up for travel. I'm using them up either here or at our home up north. And a couple of repeats. Thyroid, if you haven't had yours checked, get it checked. And because you have two homes doesn't mean you use things up twice as fast. It means half as fast. I just happen to go through these at the same time. These sure deodorants, swear by them. Both Mark and I use them. I like the um, scented or fresh and cool. There's a couple different ones I like that have a soft scent, just something that's there. Mark likes the unscented. Either way, in 120 in our summers, this is what keeps us dry. Swear by it. So I'm really excited. I've used up a lot of makeup. And you'll see some of this is from my use up for this year. I'm super focused and so excited to go through some of this. Now first, I'm going to show you my declutters. This is the Hard Candy in Tiki. I am a girl who likes a highlight, a bright highlight. This is very gold and it's just creamy, but it's not the right tone for me. So I have decided I'm gonna let it go. Not to mention, I am so tired of breaking packaging. Another one I'm letting go is this Essence Pure Nude. Like I said, I like ones you can see from outer space. This is not it. I'm gonna show it to you beside the Essence. So, uh, sorry, this is the Essence and this is the Hard Candy. You can see they're both kind of the same color range. These are not the color that I like. So this is the uh, uh, Hard Candy, this is the Essence, and this is one I'm going to show you. This is the kind that I like. So it's all a preference. So I'm gonna let this go. If you like a subtle highlighter, you could like the Hard Candy or 
the essence, they're just not my cup of tea. And now, oh, I have one more declutter before I show you what that third highlighter was. This is the L'Oreal Brow. My brows have been too hitting you before I walk in the room because they're dark. It's so easy to do when you're blonde to have way too dark, easily over dramatic brows. This is not that dark of a color and yet, boy, does it go on. If you were brunette, you would probably love this, even though the color is blonde. It builds up, it's very um, dramatic. Even when you're doing light strokes, I have a very difficult time getting it to look more natural. So I'm letting it go. I prefer to do my um, e.l.f. brow pencil. And another one that I'm kind of quasi letting go is my ColourPop in brown. I got this for Christmas and I'm not a big brown girl and every time I would open this up, a piece of it would fall out. It's gone. So whether you want to call it a declutter because I really didn't use it, like big pieces would fall off of it or a use up. Either way, it's gone. So now for the items that I've used up and I'm so excited. This is my Mary Luminizer and there's a little bit more around the edge but it's starting to break and when it breaks it will continue breaking and it makes a mess in the bathroom and this is i've done such a great job i'm so proud of myself i am more than happy to let that go and i would not repurchase i like wet and wild and i'll link the one if i can think of it that i have up north that i like but wet and wild you just get amazing highlighters for the money and i don't see any reason to spend it on this um, and by the way, I have no qualms spending on products if I can't find the drugstore. But when there's drugstore, why pay more? The e.l.f. concealer, I used this up. This one is in light peach. It was too light for me underneath here. It's a beautiful concealer if you can find the right color. I used this up uh, for contouring, you know, hiding some of my shadows, as well as, as an eye primer. And it's gorgeous. It's just this one is not the right color. My Essence Volume Mascara, I, this is a primer. I really, really, really love this primer. Thank you, Kathy. She has great makeup recommendations. Go check out Kathy's Beauty Care Chats. This is something I put on underneath my mascara every day, and it really, no matter what mascara you're using, it is a fabulous primer. I used up this Milani, uh, it's a lipstick, but I used it as a lip gloss. It's very light. It has a very fruity smell to it. It's nice, but it's one I'm glad to have used up and would not repurchase. This um, NYX Butter Lip Balm, it's just really, really pink. I had this beside my computer and I would reapply it throughout the day. And that's how I use that up. I'm letting this lipstick go. I've used a huge amount of it, but I realize every time I put it on, it's a lot darker. My tastes have changed, which is another reason to not get backups. This is in 918C. Uh, it's called Brandy by Wet n Wild. I think it's Wet n Wild. I'll put it down below. It's a very pretty color, but it's just a little too dark and dramatic for me. And then I've used up this Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Driver. It's too brown. I used it up and then I would top it with something that gave it a little more color. I love these Maybelline matte inks, but just not in this color. I like Seductress is actually probably my favorite. And then finally, I used up some false lashes. I get 10 for under $2 off of eBay. They have all different kinds of styles. This one happens to be 002. I would reorder this. I loved it. Uh, my girlfriends from China send me a lot of things and they got me into these and now I order them off of eBay all the time. They are fantastic. So that's everything I used up for February. I'm really, really thrilled with how much I'm using up, how much I'm putting a dent in my stash and starting to get things down more. I kind of get a little discouraged, I have to admit, after my birthday and then Christmas that I feel like I'm overwhelmed again because I generously, thanks to my friends and family, get some amazing gifts but I am happier when I get my things down to where I enjoy them and I can use them and 
just have products that I like that I'm really, really enjoying and can use all of them. So this makes me happy to use some things up. Thank you for watching and spending some of your time with me. I hope you're having an amazing day and we'll talk to you next time.